So today we have another Dirty Floor unboxing. Uh, just trying stuff differently. So a couple days ago I got the Rode microphone. This is actually another mic. Uh, the Rode microphone is going to be for a certain camera that will be in field. This is a Snowball Black Ice microphone. Now this will be mainly for desktop. Uh, things like in, uh, for the computer. So the, um, the road is for the camera. The blue snowball is for uh, the computer, like uh, recording video games and things like that. <clears throat> you know, so this will plug right into the computer. Be uh, everything will be done through OBS or whatever. But yep, I'm excited about this one as well. I needed some microphones. Let's see what's in this side of the box. Okay, so two packages. Whoa. Alright, so that's the actual microphone. Wow, it's heavy. That's something else. I need tweezers to that. Let's see. What's in this bad boy? Is that beeping again? Awesome. Owner's manual, which looks pretty big. Here goes the tripod stand for it. But I actually have another stand I will be using. Oh, that's one of the silica packs. Whatever got put in there accidentally. All right, USB cable. That's right here. Now, I'm gonna just assume this doesn't take any batteries or open up in any way. That's it there. The old blue snowball. This is a stand to it. Many of you guys have probably seen streamers and uh, various people, um, various YouTubers and streamers use this. It's pretty common. It's a pretty durable mic. Let's go ahead and look at some things. All right, and then we just open up like that. And that would be it. Put it right next to the computer. It's supposed to do pretty good with uh, capturing sound. But as you can see, there is another box. So this was, um, this box in here was an optional stand thing. So. Yep, all right, so for the blue Yeti, many of you guys have probably seen these and this. I wanna keep this box aside because I keep all the boxes. This is kind of the trash pile here. So this is a microphone stand, this is a desk stand. This is um, one of the pop filters that you would use. Everyone's kind of seen these. Now, this didn't come together, just so you know. So the Blue Yeti, the stand and all that stuff. Uh, okay, this is definitely interesting, but essentially you would close it on here. So you close it on here, and this is the front of the mic. I'll adjust it later, but that would be your pop filter, essentially. And I think it's backwards. That would be it, but um, I'll, I'll customize adjust it later and all that. Kind of a little bit weird. And then this right here is the arm to it. So I gotta see if it's gonna fit properly. A little bit smaller than I anticipated. Oh, wow. A lot of things on here. Alright. That's a save box. Instructions. We'll keep that. Alright. That's a desk clamp. Alright. 
looks like that's an added thing. Really, they're gonna start working now. Whatever. All right, so. This piece looks like it's already ready. So let's gonna take this off. Let's hope this works. This is one of these things where it's like requested. Oh shit. Alright, so let's try hang on. Okay, I think. This will allow me to put it on there to put this on. Bingo. All right. All right, just like that. This would be the desk arm. Not as big as I thought it would be. Um, this is an extra microphone piece, which obviously will keep. This right here I'm going to keep as well, but we're going to take it apart. So that's a little stand that will just be directly for the desk. Right. And then here goes the piece that goes into... see. Right. I don't know how thick my desk is. It's about probably that thick. It's about an inch. This is nice. The thing though, um, this arm thing is a little bit smaller than I thought, but no, it's not bad. It's just a little bit smaller than I I had originally anticipated. Okay. Alright. Alright, which side's the front? Okay, it looks like this is a front. So we wanna push this. It's about there. That could go tighter, like so. Okay. You like this position, that could go tighter. This arm thing for the pop filter though, I'll look on Line or YouTube how far you're supposed to have it. I'm assuming about that far. You see some people it's like this and then some people it's like way out here. It looks like it's like probably about six, seven inches out from the mic. Alright, that's tightened. Like you don't want that thing going anywhere. That's saying, yeah, pretty good, I'd say. Good setup, for sure. And hopefully this improves uh, some video quality, for sure. And for extra mics, I was like, oh, I'll just stick that in there for now. We'll just stick that like that. And that's on the blue. Yep, that's the blue snowball one and definitely looking forward to using it and this will give a lot of really good advice in here so it's definitely good this is definitely a great mic for narration and streaming and things like that but all right that's it for this one see you guys around